In the news tonight, man charged with the murder of his 88-year-old grandmother and teenager arrested for the murder of Pork Knocker. The indictable charge of murder was today read to Yannick Gilpin, the man accused of killing his 88-year-old grandmother, Patricia Boville. Gilpin appeared before Magistrate Delon Bess in the Georgetown Magistrate's Court, where he was not required to plea. He was later remanded to prison until April 11th. Boville's body was discovered dumped on an empty lot opposite her home on Russell Street, Charlestown, on March 22nd. The suspect reportedly told relatives that the woman was sick and he had taken her to the hospital. He later admitted to police investigators to the gruesome murder and detailed his version of what transpired. The police reported that the naked body of Boville was found partially decomposed and wrapped in a white sheet in a garbage pile. Guyana ride into the future with the next generation eco-friendly Axiom installed elevators and escalators. Call us today on telephone number 619-0899 or 6048-0934. Email us at axiomliftsgy at gmail.com for affordable elevators, escalators, moving walks, industrial lifts, home solutions, modernization, repair and servicing. Axiom Elevator Services, technology for people on the move. Running late and can't wait to the gate? We got you. The Guyana Public Service Cooperative Credit Union Limited has introduced a fast and easier way to make payments to your accounts through the GT&T mobile money services. Here's how. Click on the MMG app. Under Services, select Pay Bills. When you are there, look for the Financial Institution option. Once that is done, select Guyana Public Service Cooperative Credit Union Limited to pay your loan or make payments to your savings. Payments to the credit union made easier. GPS CCU, the credit union you can bank on. A 17-year-old is in police custody in connection with the murder of a 21-year-old man in the Northwest District. The police in a press statement said the body of Shamron Benjamin, a pork knocker of Quarry Top, Port Kaituma, was found lying on a parpet at approximately one hour today in Four Mile Village by a 64-year-old farmer. Benjamin, according to the police, was last seen alive an hour earlier drinking in the company of the teenager. They were both said to be intoxicated. The name of the teenager was withheld because of his age. Benjamin was pronounced dead on arrival at the Port Kaituma Hospital. A post-mortem examination is to be conducted on the body to determine the exact cause of death. At the scene, the police found the rock with what appeared to be bloodstained. The teenage suspect was arrested some seven hours later. Guyana, ride into the future with the next generation eco-friendly Axiom installed elevators and escalators. Call us today on telephone number 619-0899 or 6048-0934. Email us at axiomliftsgy at gmail.com for affordable elevators, escalators, moving walks, industrial lifts, 
Home Solutions Modernization Repair and Servicing. Axiom Elevator Services. Technology for people on the move. Washi. Hi, people. Washing made so easy since I found Washi. Washi me use, wash me clothes and I can say... Wash your soap powder, wash clothes so nice. Wash your soap powder, leave your clothes color bright. Wash your soap powder, leave me clothes smelling nice, of course. So give thanks for wash your soap powder for doing my laundry in right. Keep my clothes color bright. Have my clothes smelling nice for sure. I could not ask for more. Comes in lemon and original. It is a washing machine in a pack. Wash your soap powder, wash clothes so nice. Wash your soap powder, leave your clothes color bright. Wash your soap powder, have my clothes smelling nice, of course. Distributors located in the Starbrook market. Pro Media Professional Live Streaming Service. Experience the difference when it's live. Pro Media provides you a complete range of live and demand streaming solutions, no matter what your special event may be. Weddings, funerals, concerts, Press conferences, conventions, seminars, workshops, meetings, religious events, and more. For more information, call 669-5376 or 609-5264. Experience the difference when it's live. Facing backlash for the sentiments expressed at a public meeting in Buxton, executive member of the Working People's Alliance, Tukuma Agunsi, said his party is prepared to use civil disobedience if he's arrested and charged. He told supporters at a public meeting that the WPA wants to make it clear that the local government elections offered us an opportunity to start the resistance. According to the long-serving WPA member, treason seems the most severe of the threats. We announced civil disobedience and we prepared to use civil disobedience as an effective political weapon. And that would be one of our responses. And we have said it in public that when we look at the lineup of charges they have been uttering since the, the controversy, treason seems to be the most severe of the threats. And myself and the WPA has publicly re um, resolve in public at once they come with treason charges we will not treat it as a legal matter we would see it as what it is a political matter and i will go in the court and plead guilty with the explanation it was at a public meeting some weeks ago that Ogunsi posited that the June 12 local government elections should be used as a day of national resistance an African uprising in Guyana. There has been lots of chatter and condemnation of the WP executive member. For these and other stories, do visit us at our website www.rdproductiongy.com. <laughs>